Hello, and welcome to another playthrough. This one is Subnautica. Uh, I've played this game before, although I didn't finish it. Good lord, that's noisy. It reminds me of some flights I had when I was in the Air Force. <laughs> uh, Alright, minus the being knocked out, of course. Anyway, I have played this game before. Uh, but I never finished it because I was basically, I was playing it to, uh, pass some time, uh, and I ended up doing, let's pick that up and let's put this fire out, shall we? There we go. All right. It's quieted down. Yeah. So anyway, uh, yeah, I played it until I got bored, and, uh, okay, and, um, got busy with, uh, work stuff again, so. Oh, wow, well, sure, yeah. There we go. All right, good luck for me. Okay, good. Yay. Okay, so anyway, this is going to be uh, an entire... Oops, tab. So many games going on right now, I can't remember which one's which. Uh, can I put this back in the thingy? You know, the thingy's broken, so I can't put it back in there. All right, so if you're not familiar with this game, basically what happened, we were in a spaceship, uh, and it crashed into a planet, and we got out in an escape pod. That's all we know right now. Um... So, we have to go... This is a, basically an open-world game with a storyline. Uh, so, we've got to go and try and get off the planet, I assume. Yes, I've, like I said, I've played this before, but I'm kind of playing dumb right now. All right. So, we got, like, look, this thing needs fixed. Use repair tool. Uh, this needs fixed over here. I need to use a repair tool on that. Do I have a repair tool? I just have a fire extinguisher. Is there anything in here? Yes, there is something in here, but it's not a repair tool. So, uh, let's go out the bottom here and get right to it. Let's get going here. We ain't have to waste time. We ain't got no time to waste. Oh, look. Stuff. Ah. And as you can tell, I am... Oh, wow. Let's grab this fish. All right. Uh, what else can we grab while we're down here? Yeah, usually they do. Is there anything in here we could take? No, but we can grab that later. All uh, right, so let's get, uh, see if we can get some Risa. Aha! No, oh, come here. Oh, doggone it, I wasn't able to grab it. Oh, we'll get it. We'll come back down after we get some oxygen and grab it. Let's get back down there. Uh, where did that go? There it is. All right. Copper ore. Very nice. Let's, let's uh, grab this. And some of this. And one of these. And one of those. And one of that. Yeah, those animals are interesting sounding, aren't they? Swim to the surface, hurry, before we die. Aha. See, there's the life pod we came in on. So let's go and grab some more of these resources, because we're going to need some resources to get started with the game. All right. Now, because I've already played this, I know basically what I need to do up to a certain point in the game. Um that I never passed, uh, never never got to because I stopped playing. But like I said before, this is going to be a complete playthrough, at least that is the plan, uh, because I'm going to put it on the YouTubes there. All right, so let's go over here, because I know for a fact we're going to need some of the stuff that's over here uh, to build things. <clears throat> let's get down there. Uh, oh, looks like the nearest stuff I need is right over here. Or the stuff I did... Whatever. English! 
All right. That should be enough. We got a new blueprint. Woohoo! Look at me go. All right, so let's go back over here. And do I have enough room to bring more stuff back? I do. I can bring stuff. Ah. Ah. Okay, cool. So you can grab this metal salvage. That's always good to pick up. Well, not always, but often good to pick up um, because you will most likely need it. All right, so I'm running back here with a, or swimming back, I should say, with a full load of stuff. Let's see what we can build with this stuff. I've got to build a scanner. I need to build a repair tool. Uh, what else do I need to build? Um, let's see, scanner repair tool. Uh, all sorts of things. We'll, we'll find out when we get in here. Okay, back into the life pod, or lifeboat, whatever you want to call it. The uh, escape pod. All right, so I need food first, so let's make some, let's cook some of these fish up here. Now, I could use the rations that I have in the, the case down there, but I'm not going to. Okay, so let's eat this. Let's grub on these, all right. So, there we go. Oops. Now, what else do I need to do? I need to make... Uh, oh, let's go down here. And equipment, tools. I need to make one of these. I need to make a scanner. I need to make a repair tool. And I need to make a caniff. A caniffy. All right. So I need to make the caniffy, I need silicone rubber. How do I make silicone rubber? Well, I go up here, I use my creepvine seeds, and I make a silicone rubber. And then what else do I need? I need... I'm going to need a battery and another silicone rubber and some cave sulfur. Okay, so let's get this going, the scanner. Uh, I need a battery. What do I need to make a battery? Let's see. Oh, look, a mushroom and some copper ore. I have that already. Imagine that. So let's make that. And now I can make the scanner. I can make the caniffy. And I can make... An O2 tank, which will let me breathe underwater longer. And I would also like to make some fins. So I need two silicone rubber. Now, how do I make those? Again, we just go up here and we actually do that. Mm -hmm. All right. And then I can make some. Now, the fins will allow me to swim faster. Okay. All right. Don't shut up. My gosh. Okay, so let's get rid of this fire extinguisher. I don't need that. Let's... Oh, I can... I can... Oh, my... Just shut up. Jeez. Uh, I can put some titanium. I can turn that uh, metal scrap that I had into titanium. All right, so let's put all of this stuff into the case here. The theme of bobber. All right. And there we go. Now I'm going to set this up how I normally want it. I want this in slot one. To move the slot, you just, like it says there, bind it. You use the keyboard to bind it to whatever slot you want it in. Okay, so let us go back down into the water. And let's start scanning things. This, this lets you up get new technology, all right? So we're going to scan this sea glide fragment here. All right. Uh, what else do I want? I need some cave sulfur. Now, where do I find that? Oh, I can find it down here. Yes. On the other end of this tube, though. It's not here. Well, let's, oops. Let's scan this limestone chunk just to scan it. Just to check, tick off that box. Let's get more of this, too. One more, at least. So let's go back up for some air. There's a creature egg down here, too, which we're not going to pick up now, but eventually we'll get... We'll work on that, most likely. All right. And let's go back down here. Now, for somebody like me, this game is actually kind of, uh... I wouldn't say scary, but it... Yeah, it's kind of scary, to to put it away, I guess. Uh, because I am... A, oh, I can't remember what it's called, but scared of uh, open water. Even though I can swim really well and I grew up around beaches my whole life, I don't like open water. 
Come on. Come on. Come on. Come get me. There's a creature in here that you get the 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 uh, sulfur deposits from, and they explode essentially. So I'm trying to get it to come and explode, so I can get the sulfur. Let's get back up here and get some oxygen, some air. I should have made a light, a uh, a lantern, if you will, but yeah, whatever. I think that that creature's in this side. Let's scan that real quick. Silver, woo! -hoo. Lead, gold. Maybe it's down here. Oh no, this I'm going back and it's dark. I should probably go make a light bulb or a lantern or a floodlight, whatever it's called. Maybe maybe I'll do that. Yeah, I'll do that right now. Let's go back through this tunnel here or this coral thingy, my bob, and uh, head back to the. Uh, the thing because it's getting a little bit dark it's getting hard to see stuff let's grab two of these i'll just scan that mushroom while we're at it even though we already we already got the stuff we need from it the data or whatever you want to call it let's go over here back over to the life pod oh i can build the sea glide now too that was one of the goals for this video is uh, to build the sea glide to get to that point where i could all right, so let's go over here and build, well, let's, deployables, sea glide, copper wire, battery lubricant, and, okay, we need some lubricant, copper wire, and a battery. So for lubricant, I already know that I need one of those. Oops. And so let's build a battery. Let's build some lubricant, or create some lubricant, if you would like to be more proper. Uh, what else do we need? We need some copper. Let's get some, co let's add more copper there. Oops. Keep hitting the wrong key. Um, what did we need? Uh, oh, copper wire. Yes, that's right. I think I got all I need for the sea glide now. Uh... Yes, this is a huge help because it lets us uh, swim faster or move faster, I should say, underwater. Oh, shut up. Um, let's see here. Tools. Uh, a battery and some glass. So can I make a battery right now? Yes. Can I make some glass right now? Of course. Uh, let's move that over. All right. Oops. Uh, glass. There we go. All right, perfect. Uh, this sea glide is. Oops, I need to make the light, don't I? There we go. Now this sea glide is going to be in slot five. This is going to be in slot four, which it already is. All right, good. There we go. Oops. All right, so let's put all this crap that we're not going to use right now back into the box. We're running out of space in our box here. All right, now we're going to use the sea glide. Look at us go. Okay, so where is that place? Uh, it's hard to see in the dark here. Uh, it's somewhere. Uh, right click. Yes, there we go. Aha, light bulb. The sea glide has a light, a headlight on it. Uh, so that's what I was clicking on. Yep, there we go. Got one. Got him. Here he comes. Yep. Ah, woo. Got him. There we go. Now I got the cave sulfur. Here we, why don't we grab this fish as well? Uh, oh, actually, let's try and scan this fish. There we go. <laughs> that was interesting. Uh, let's grab it. Because we're going to use that for water, I think. 
Uh, what else is down here? Anything? Anything of use? Eh, not really. How do I get out of here? Okay, that's the way out. That's the Osfart. Uh, oop. Come here. Come hither. There we go. We use these fish for water. All right, so let's go back up here. I think I got what I need for that repair tool. Because we want to progress in the storyline here now, don't we? Uh, repair tool. I need silicone rubber and titanium. So let's... Do we have silicone rubber? Yes, we do. And... Oop. Right click. I keep forgetting. Right click. Silicone rubber and titanium for our repair tool. There we go. Now we can repair this and we can progress in the storyline. Um... Or is that repair? Oh, why did I got the fish in my inventory? Oh, because it automatically goes to your inventory. Duh. All right, so let us repair. Yeah, look at that. Strange, strange way to repair something, but all right, cool, whatever. Let's go over here and repair the radio, too. <clears throat> mm hmm. All right. I think we're operating good now. We we operating good. Ah, yeah, 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 whatever. Okay, we're going to grab that. The thing with these medical kit fabricators is they will fabricate a new medical kit. As you can see, the little 1% right there. Uh, it'll go up to 100%, and obviously, then you have a new medical thingy or a new medical kit. What I like to do with these is uh, whenever I see this... Uh, has one in it even if I have one in my inventory like right now I like to take that out and put it in there okay in the storage container so I always have at least one backup uh, now what I want to do here is I want to move this to my invent or my uh, hot bar I want to see if I can put it back in here I, I can't why can't I put it back in there whatever whatever okay I don't I don't care doesn't matter. What? Oh, let me in there. There we go. All right. Let's put that back because that's basically useless now. Uh, we'll keep that in inventory. Now, to progress it in the storyline, we need to go over here and listen to the radio. Aha, <clears throat> uh -huh, yeah. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Well, that's a long time. I don't think I have that much time. All right, so let's, uh, while this thing's running its mouth, let's make some fish. Some cooked fish. Uh, I can also make water out of this fish. <laughs> Which is kind of strange, but all right. It works, right? Let's uh, drink this water and eat this fish. Is there another message? No, there's not. So while we wait for another message, because that's how the storyline progresses is through these messages. Uh, why don't we go look for more resources? Let's go back in here. This is my favorite cave because there's all sorts of goodies in here. Anything behind there? No. Anything on the ceiling that I want? No, not really. I've used most of the resources in here. So let's go back in here. There's going to be another one of those uh, creatures there that's going to attack us, but uh, that's fine. Oop, here's another one. Another limestone outcrop. Uh, there's See, there's one of those creatures right there, those uh, sulfur creature thingies. Yeah! Peace out! <laughs> it sounded like two of them exploded. All right, let's get back up and get some oxygen. Get some air. And let's get back down. down what? Down there. All right, down into here. Getting more resources. Get them resources. Get that sulfur, too. Even though, you really, I don't think you need it often. Uh, let's get it anyway. Is there anything in here that I want? Other than the sulfur. 
Doesn't look like... Oh, yeah, we'll take this, too. Uh, other than that, I don't think there's really anything left in here that I want. Now, I think this regener regenerates uh, the resources over time, I believe. Could be wrong. All right, so let's get out of this one and go across the street over here into this area and grab these resources. I don't think there's a... Uh creature in here. It has a creature egg, but there's not one of those exploding creatures in here. Alright, very good. Let's get back up to the surface. Let's go do some hunting for stuff to scan. How about we do that? We're gonna grab this, pick up that salvage, pick up the salvage, uh, and we're gonna go scanning for things. Well, I don't know what this is. Ooh, mobile, ve mobile vehicle bay fragment. We need that for sure. Get out of the box. Um, some salt. We'll take the salt. Sure, why not? We'll need that to make water. Uh, what else is down here? Not much. Let's get the sea glide going again. Uh, can we scan this? Yes, we can. I don't think we'll really need that information but we'll get it anyway metal salvage and scan the metal salvage and what do we do with this oh, I, I don't know it's part of the ship i don't know what to do with it let's scan it uh anyway <laughs> uh is there anything down here that i can use there's some salt down there uh doesn't look like there's much of anything down here so let's get back down there and keep keep looking for stuff to use all right because we need to... Uh, we're not going to worry about that right now. That's salvage. Uh, ooh, that's a deep hole, isn't it? Um, we need to... Oh, here's a wreck. We can look at this. What's? Is there anything in this wreck we can use? And when I say anything in the wreck, I don't mean stuff like I just picked up. I'm talking about uh, stuff I can scan for technology, for upgrades and things. Ooh, what's this? Aha! Beacon fragment. That looks tasty. Let's grab that. Alright. So I'm halfway to being able to construct a beacon now. What, is there anything in here? A beacon fragment. Oh no, a sea glide fragment. We already got one of those, but we'll scan it anyway. That turns into a... Uh, if we've already scanned something, it turns into titanium for us. We'll, it will get titanium instead of the knowledge. Uh, where's my thingy, my Bob? It's over there. Okay, so. Let's get back down there. There's a lot of this in the game. Uh, up and down, up and down, especially in the beginning. Anything over here? No, not really. What is this? It's some stuff. Uh, anything else? Over? Can I scan this thing? No, not really. Alright, so that wreck looks like it's been... Yeah, there's nothing left there for us, it looks like. Oh, except this beacon fragment, perhaps. Yep, there we go. We have learned how to make a beacon. Beacon sounds an awful lot like bacon, and bacon is tasty. Anything else around here? Nah, not really. Uh, what about over here? Eh, it doesn't look like it. Ooh, there's a box down there. Let's get up to the surface. Let's get up here. And let's get back down there and see what is in this box. If there's anything helpful, hopefully there's something useful in here. Maybe. Oh, it looks like it's a cutting tool. That will come in handy to get uh, upgrades as later. Uh, what else is down here? Ooh, what is this? This looks interesting, whatever it is. A bioreactor fragment. Ooh, ah. There's something over here, too. What is it? Oh, this is a scanner room fragment. Yes, yes. Give me all the knowledge. Let's grab the salt. Let's get back up. Back up to the surface. Oop, let's grab this too while we're on the way up. 
Ooh, another box. Let's see what's in that box. After we get to the surface and get some more oxygen. What's in here? Anything useful? Ooh, mobile beep, mobile blah, blah, blah. new mouth. Mobile vehicle bay fragment. Yes, yes. All right. Uh, this looks like there's a bunch of scrap down here, or salvage, whatever you want to call it. We'll grab one of them uh, just to... Well, how much? Yeah, we're running out of inventory space, so we'll just grab one of those. What else is down here? Anything useful? No. Looks like we're going to continue our search for useful things. Let's go back down, 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 down. Ooh, what is this? Nope, 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 nope. Don't want to mess with that. I can imagine this game in VR would be, for a person like me, would be terrifying. Uh, let's see here. Hmm. Uh, it doesn't look like there's any wrecks over here. Ooh, there's a box. What's in the box? Ooh, mobile vehicle bay fragment. Yes, yes. Perfect. All right. Now I can build the mobile vehicle bay. But without any vehicles to put in it, it's kind of useless. But we'll learn those eventually. Mm-hmm. All right, so let's look around here. Anything down? Uh, I don't want to go down in the hole. Not quite yet. Oh, what's... Oh, no, that's just junk. Ooh, what's down here? Hopefully that thing doesn't attack me. Don't attack me, thing. A propulsion cannon fragment. Yes, yes, yes. yes. There we go. Blueprint entry unlock, but I can't build it yet. Darn. I, whatever that was sounded like it did, meant business. I don't want to mess with it, whatever it is. Anything else around here? Hmm. No, it doesn't look like... Oh, we got a radio message. Well, we should probably get back to the lifeboat, the life pod, the whatever, to... Uh, Read that message. So let's get back there. Uh, where's the boat at? Oh, there's a lifeboat, life pod, whatever. Escape pod. Is there anything down here that we could use? No. This... Oh, this... 3D holographic thing is really irritating on this... this uh, uh, sea glide because you can't turn it on without having the, or you can't turn the headlight on without also having this stupid holographic display on and it gets in the way of seeing things all right let's see is there anything around here that huh. oh yeah there's a box down there I don't know if I already got that one but we'll check it out Where is it at? Where was that box? Here it is. What's in here? What? Oh, it's a sea glide fragment. Imagine that. We'll take it. Oh, a quantum detonation. That sounds dangerous. All right, we already got this wreck. Uh, so let's go back over here to the... Uh, the thing. Well, on our way back, we'll take a roundabout way back to see if we can find more stuff around here. Huh. It's not looking like it. Oh, there's a wreck over there. Aha! Yes, 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 yes. Let's 
Let's get down there and see what's going on. Ooh, look at the... This looks like a gold mine down here, perhaps. What's down here? Let's start on this end. Ooh, looks like a... Uh, what? Uh, wrong button. Fat fingers. Scatter room fragment. Very nice. Uh, okay, what else do we have down here? Uh... A uh, nuclear waste disposal. I guess that'll come in handy later. A scanner room fragment. Very good. What else is over here? Oh, sea moth fragment. This is the goal that I wanted to get done today was sea moth. Uh, yep, 30 seconds. Good for me. Bioreactor fragment. Very good. All right, let's get back up to the surface. And then we'll get back down there and... see if there's anything that we missed. Uh, okay, is there anything down here that I missed? Uh, doesn't look like there is, but let's make sure. No, just a bunch of scrap and junk, it looks like. Stuff that I don't... Oh, wait, this might be a scannable thing. No, oh, that's metal salvage. Alright, so it's looking like this wreck is cleaned out other than the metal scrap. So that's good. Oh, wait, what's over here? What is over here? Scanner room fragment and... Nothing. So... We'll grab this. Our inventory might be full. Nope. It's probably close to full now. Let's get back up to the surface and breathe. So I need one more piece of the sea moth. And then I'll be able to build the sea moth. Which is, like I said before, which was the goal. So let's go back over here. Let's actually get back um, and and do a little more of the storyline stuff. Okay, sea glide fragment. I my oh no, I got for, I got room in the inventory for that one. Let's grab that too. Grab the uh, titanium from it. All right, so like I was uh, saying, let's let's start getting back over here to the uh, life pod, escape pod, whatever. So we can progress through the storyline a little bit with that radio massage. Wow, I wandered a long ways away. Ooh, 4% of battery left. That's what, I'm almost out of power on the Sea Glide. Good thing uh, I was paying attention here. I will. I will seek fluid intake. Ooh, can I make it? Yes, made it with just barely any battery to spare and All right, let's build another battery. Uh, I need acid mushroom. There we go. Oops. And then battery. There we go. Uh, make some water there. Let's make water. I need to make another thing of water too. So let's make some bleach. Oh, I need coral, to coral tube sample. What can I build here? Uh, nothing useful right now. Uh, okay, so this battery is going to be put back into the sea glide. New battery. Thank you much. Uh, what do I need to build? Uh, oops. I need to build the vehicle bay. What do I need for that? Uh, titanium ingot, lubricant, and a power cell. Ooh, a power cell. Okay, so we're going to need some more resources for that power cell. Uh, let's put... Well, actually, let's make the titanium ingot right now. Like that. That takes 10, I believe, uh, titanium to make. So that will free up quite a bit of room. Alright, so let's put all this 
or as much as we can into there. Uh, and then let's make all this titanium. Or not, yeah, well, get rid of this metal salvage, turn it into titanium. There we go. Uh, do I want to swap out anything? No, I do want to consume the water, though. Uh, we need water. Okay, I think that is all I can do now. I need to go get some... What did I need? I can't remember what I needed. Uh, lubricant... Oh, I need some more mushrooms for the power cell. And, fortunately for me, there are plenty of mushrooms here. One, two, three, four. Four mushrooms. Look, a creature egg, which I'm not going to scan right now. Uh, while I'm out, let's go over here to this thing. Let's breathe. So let's get over here uh, and investigate this part of the storyline. Let's see what we need to do over here. I think it's just scan some stuff, if I remember correctly. But I may not remember correctly. 190 meters. Alright, let's stick a little bit closer to the surface. As we come in on this thing. Alright, so we'll go back up for some air. Alright, so let's get up for some air here. And let's get down there. Let let us see what... Ooh, look at that. A sea moth fragment. We're going to get that yummy goodness right away. And we should be able to build the sea moth now. Woohoo! Oh, nope, not yet. Darn. Is there anything in here that I can grab? No. All right, so what other goodies are around here, if any, to... Ha Ooh, oh yes, there we go. Sea moth fragment. Oh yeah. Now we're going. Now we're now we're cooking with something. I don't know. Uh, with gas. Uh, let's see. Is there anything down here that I want? Nah. Let's go back up to the surface before we drown. <clears throat> Also need to get some of uh, that table coral, table coral stuff. So let's get back over here, and I can start making the table coral. Oh, what is this? This looks interesting. Aha, a time capsule. All right, uh, something. I, I don't really carry about carry. I don't really care about the storyline itself. I just care about the storyline from the point of progression. So I, I'm not going to stop to actually read all of the storyline stuff. All right. 30 seconds. Um, Where's that table coral at? All right, I'm going to run out of oxygen if I sit here staring. Okay, there's table coral over here. I know that for a fact. I think there's... Let's grab two more just in case. Because I can't remember the uh, what the recipe for water is. All right, for, well, for bleach. Bleach is salt deposit and a coral tube sample, so it's a one-to-one -one thing. Uh, salt deposit, two of those. Oops. Yeah, I am going to seek fluid intake. Just behave. Got that. Got that. This will give me four bottles of water. Uh, there we go. Yes. Drink water. Two. Three water. Okay, now I need some food. Uh, I'm not going to worry about food at this moment. 
All right, what else did I was... Oh, I was going to make one of these things. Uh, power cell. Okay, so we need two batteries. So that means I need a bunch of copper ore. That means I need four, if my memory serves me correctly, four copper ore. Uh, one and a two. Oh, no, it was two copper ore and four mushrooms. That's what it was. Uh, power cell, I need silicone rubber for that. Do I have any here? No, I do not. So let's just make some. Oops. Keep hitting the wrong doggone button. There we go. Okay, so now I need a lubricant and a power cell. All right, so let's get make the power cell and then make lubricant. Uh, lubricant is up here like that. And a mobile vehicle bay. There we go. Okay, so we got the mobile vehicle bay built. We just need to deploy it out in the water. But I also want to, like I said before, my goodness, this takes a long time to build. Like I said before, I want to build the sea moth this episode. So what do we need for the sea moth? Titanium ingot, uh, two glass, a power cell, some lubricant, and lead. Okay, that's easy enough. Especially now that we got this uh, sea glide to go all over the place. Uh, so let's grab all this titanium here. All, all, oops, no, I can't grab all this titanium because my inventory's full, isn't it? Um, uh, we got two copper ore there. That's fine. Uh, one of those. A thermo blade. Ooh, hello. Let's use that instead of this other knife here. So this knife can go over there. Why do I have two of these? I don't know, but we'll put this one over there. Um, oh, I see what... Okay, yeah, because I got these from that ship over there, I guess. Or that thing. I don't know, whatever. Uh, Alright, so let's put this in there. Let's see if we can make two of these titanium ingots. Or did I need one? I thought I needed two. I don't remember. Let's check. No, one. Okay. And then, uh, let's see. Some lubricant, lead. I already got the lead. Uh, we're going to need stuff for a power cell. No, I don't want to release the vehicle bay right now, but thank you. Four. All right. Um, let's get over here and grab some more of this stuff over here that we're going to need to build. Some lubricant and silicone rubber and all sorts of good things. Oh, inventory full. Darn. You run into that problem a lot in this game, uh, is inventory management. Uh, eventually we can build, like, uh, cabinets and things. And you can, right now I can even build uh, lockers to put out here, but I don't like to do that. It's kind of... All right, we got another message on the console, on the radio thing, but I'm not going to worry about that at the moment. I am going to pursue this thing here. All right, so can I build two batteries? Hopefully. Yes, two batteries. And a power cell. And lead. One lead, please. I need two glass. All right, that's easy enough to do. Uh, but I'll need to get more of this. Yes, I will need to get more of that. So let's go back down here. Uh, where is that big tube, That my favorite tube ever? Where is it at? There it is. This has all sorts of goodies in there. Uh, one quartz. Two quartz. There we go. So, in less than an hour, we will have gotten the sea moth, which is awesome. One glass, two glass, 
And just to make sure before we go out, we can build the sea moth. We have the vehicle bay, we can build the sea moth now. All right. So let us, well, actually, before we do that, let us go in here and we'll climb the ladder. This is what you're supposed to do at the beginning of the game, but I, did it, I didn't do it on purpose. Aha, there we go. So that's the beginning of the game, all right? Or which, at least what you're supposed to do. Okay, so why don't we deploy the mobile vehicle bay to build this sea moth? We're going to put it in slot three. Uh, and there we go. Uh, we'll just put it somewhere. Uh, right here looks good. All right. Now, what shall we do? We'll build a sea moth. <laughs> there we go. Go, oh, yes. Yes, it is. Go for that booty hole. All right. Look at that. Sea moth. Woohoo. All right. Now, what's cool about it is it has a slot for upgrades. You can upgrade this for, like, more depth uh, capability. You could be able to go deeper, uh, some cargo carrying capacity, and so on and so forth. But this is the sea moth. A little bit quicker than uh, what we're used to. All right. So we're going to park it right here and get out and go visit that radio and see what, what's going on here. We got the sea moth. Mm-hmm. All right. Where are they at? They're over there. We're going to go visit this. Actually, no, we're not going to go visit this. We got the sea glide. We got the next radio beacon that we want to deal with. So I think that this is a success for the first episode. We're about 45 minutes in, which is nice. Uh, so anyway, uh, we'll pick up in the next episode with going over there and investigating that wreck over there. Or the life pod, I should say. Uh, and to see what's going on. And I think the next milestone might be a cyclops. I don't know. That might be a little bit long. Uh, but thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed. And see you next time.